<laughs> Hello and welcome to Vlogmas Day 2. I had actually already pre-filmed everything for this day because I decorated for Christmas two days ago and then I realized I wanted to add stuff because what the hell, it is completely sunny out. I have not seen the sun in like, I'm not kidding, three weeks. I also got my earrings on because it's the holiday season. I painted my nails this beautiful emerald color yesterday and I'm out for a nice walk because honestly, it's amazing. So everything you're about to see, one clip is the advent calendar from this morning and the next clip after is all stuff from two days ago. Um, so it kind of looks like a duck. Looks like they're trying to make it a duck. Ooh, it's premium. Is that just milk? Yeah, I would say so. I don't want milk. So here you go. Good morning. I look in a lot of them are milk chocolate. That's probably true. I think this is this entire one though. I'll try. It says assorted. Oh, here it says all the ones that are inside. Today is pre-filming of Vlogmas Day 2 featuring Tommy. Yeah, we open presents together in front of your fireplace in uh, Perth. Ah, uh, yes, that was definitely. Yes. <laughs> okay, so little haul from yesterday, like I said I was gonna do. Yesterday. Yesterday. I got two new sets of Christmas lights because one of our sets broke in the circuit, so I decided to get more anyway because I don't remember if we have enough for the tree and for where I want to line them up here. We left the ones on the border all year because they just fit really well. Oh, afterwards I went to Indigo and bought my secret person in work a book about doing like the full thing. And then I got a backup planner for 2022. And now, Christmas things. You ready, sweetie? I put on my Christmas sweater my brother got many years ago. In these boxes is every single Christmas thing we've accumulated, plus a couple of other things that we bought at some point that I just don't have over here. But we have ornament boxes, we have tree boxes, we got tree, we got all the stuff that came from our trip home to our respective childhood homes, and some cards. So I'm gonna lay this all out first. So we have lots of things. We named some of the things we got in Vancouver too, or not in Vancouver, gosh, in Perth. What did we name? This is uh, Sergey. no, this is Morris. This is Sergey. What did we name him? Michael, Michael yes, of course. Mikey Mike. Uh, so yeah, I did find other lights. I found the garlands for the tree that I used before. A lot of these ornaments are not fitting on the tree, so I've debated how we're gonna hang them otherwise. Some of these things actually stand on their own, so they'll be easier to just display on the table over there like this. Uh, uh, our stockings that we can hang together after you're done eating. <laughs> Which one's yours? That one? Yeah. Oh, and then mine has Santa. There's something inside. It's the envelope of a card. Stockings and the tree, a little baby tree, and our Santa hats. Oh, and an ornament my dad gave me last year. And oh yes, I'm glad I had these. I almost bought more stickers that I definitely didn't need. This is another feature from your mom. And these are our Christmas trees that I showed when we were in Vancouver. I know where I'm gonna put those already.
smaller than mine. Oh, good. Okay. I'll take mine and take my ponytail out. I think it's still too small. Ah, yes. Now this one. Perfect. Excellent. <laughs> I love you. So I guess this is just my life until Christmas Day? Yes. Oh. So I have fully finished decorating. I'm going to give you a little bit of a tour. The table right now is not fully set because it's actually there for a Christmas card writing that I, in this, will have put into a vlog for another day. Um, I'm going to be sending out these cards pretty soon because I want them to get to everybody in December before Christmas hits, so let's do a tour of the space. It's dark, obviously. <laughs> Excuse me. <sighs> Still trying to shake this cough, guys. All right, so the perimeter lights are always there, but I've added in the garland and the lights over here. So we got some really nice lights over here. We got the tree with all of the little friends. We got a nice little mailbox here that I love. Our standing friends and our first ornament together that I got for Tommy and I customized. And any leftover ornaments are hanging, <coughs> oh, excuse me, <coughs> back here. I fully decked out this section over here as well. So we have a little candy dish. I have an ornament that a student gave me when I was a coach. I put a new set of batteries in so these lights would light up. And we got a Santa, a snow globe that I bought back in October, and one of the Christmas trees that I bought when we were in Perth. This part, <laughs> Gnome Sweet Gnome, and it's got little lights. This is the owl we picked up when we were in Perth as well, and he's here. We have this Let It Snow stocking that used to be on our tree, and we have a wreath up here, which I love. And, oh, the other wreath, I forgot, is just hanging here. So, let's zoom in on the tree really quick. So, we got a lot going on here, but the 2021 magnet, I mean, ornament is amazing. The gnome one from Perth. This one is from Raleigh. This is from my work, actually. Somebody made them last year. This is the Santa sweater that I got that I like. And this is a little ornament for the senators that Tommy really likes. And the rest of them are just the generic ones that we already had from last year at the dollar store. But I love the tree. I love this table, how it turned out. And I'm really happy about it. And finally, we have the stockings over here. I just put the gnome um, napkins here. Oh, I'm gonna like the canvas really quick. Okay, well, maybe not. I got this little, I think we called him Michael? Yeah, we named him Michael. And then here to match, I know I put the green Christmas tree over there as we saw already, but I bought like three of a different color. And this just matched pretty well with the taupe kind of color with the purple and the white and the white. So I just decided to leave these there as a little final Christmas spark in our space so yeah i'm gonna try and light these candles up and that is the end of vlogmas day two so thank you for watching and i'm excited for the rest of vlogmas i don't know what we're gonna get up to because it's funny how we've been traveling and that's all the exciting stuff that people normally save for vlogmas time but we deliberately traveled in november so Everything that we've done has been amazing other than the fact that we got super sick and it's been a really great time since we've been back because we've been able to sleep, we've been back in our own beds, it's been really nice. So I'm going to write Christmas cards and I will see you in the next one.